Hey everyone, welcome back to Soft and Chill, he's Lewis. Curve. Yes, today we're going to be watching a cult classic, um, a movie that's been recommended many, many times. Uh, we have had other movies kind of on the list to watch before that, but we finally have arrived to this one, which I know a lot of people are going to be happy that we've got there. Are you excited? Yeah, very. <laughs> you stay classy, San Diego. Yeah! He could have been governor. Hey, I like that fanny. <laughs> oh, Mr. Burgundy. <laughs> Anchorman, the legend of Ron Burgundy. Burgundy did it! I am! Oh! Ron Burgundy is down! It is bad! 2004's Anchorman. <laughs> 2004, so that's 20 years ago. Will Ferrell um, is like in his prime. Um, I mean, I think he's been in his prime for years. But I know that it's got Paul Rudd in it. Um, I think it's got the block. Uh, I think it's got Steve Carell in it. Uh, over the years, I've kind of seen a, probably the occasional, the occasional clip, um, but that's it. Like um, I know that he's an Anchorman, and I know that it's Will Ferrell has been kind of let off the leash mm -hmm. to do what he wants. What have you heard about it, and what do you think it's going to be like? Uh, I know it's supposed to be funny. Yeah, and, well, yeah definitely, yeah, definitely, yeah. Um, and I just know it's called Anchorman. I'd, I've heard of it before, but. I, no, absolutely not about it, really. I think there was two of them. I think they brought out a second one, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, they might have. Uh, yeah. But I don't think it was po as popular. Um, yeah, I just, I've just heard about it over the years, and for some reason it's just kind of slipped under the radar. A lot like a, a, a lot of the other kind of comedies of just kind of, that I haven't watched things like, I don't know, like um, The Wedding Singer and stuff like that and something about mary like things like that that just have just that i just haven't kind of watched yet um let me know if i should obviously goes without saying but i'm really excited it's only on for like it's kind of like an it's, it's a shortish movie it's on just over an hour and a half so i hope you enjoy it are we really looking forward mm -hmm. to seeing it thank you so so very much for being here watching this with us today we appreciate it from the bottom of our hearts if you like the channel and you want to follow along, you can hit the like button and subscribe. We also put the full length reactions to this and other stuff over on our Patreon. I will leave a link below, but in the meantime, I'm, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm excited. Yeah. Didn't expect it to be DreamWorks. No, movie. no. To the cartoon. <laughs> I am kind of expecting big things from this, though. Mm -hmm. A bit like I was expecting big things from Superbad. The actual events. <laughs> there was a time... A time before Cable, when the local anchor man reigned supreme. His name was Ron Burgundy. Ron Burgundy looks like a pawn star. Walking amongst mere mortals, he had a voice that could make a wolverine purr. Boots <laughs> so fine they made Sinatra look like a hobo. <laughs> Ron Burgundy was the balls. <laughs> I look good. <laughs> I mean, really good. <laughs> hey, everyone! Come and see how good I look! <laughs> Come and see how good I look. Maybe don't wear a bra next time. <laughs> I don't know her name. What is it? <laughs> Lanolin? <laughs> like sheep's wool? <laughs> Scotch is got Scotch. Here it goes down. Down into my belly. <laughs> 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 The Human Torch was denied a bank loan. <laughs> mm. Look at me! It's Channel 4 News at 6 o'clock! <laughs> hey everybody! <laughs> Shut the hell up! Ron Burgundy's off! <laughs> oh, it's like a legend. Uh, well, legend of Ron Burgundy. Ron Burgundy. <laughs> oh my gosh, she said her first words! What you're about to see is a Channel 4 News exclusive. His name what? is Nutty the Squirrel. And Nutty the squirrel. Nutty? How about that? Yeah, that's hilarious. You stay classy, San Diego. Stay classy, San Diego. We are number one. We just grabbed every key demographic. So everyone absolutely yeah. loves them. Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention and listen? Cannonball! <laughs> People call me the Bry Man. I have a nickname for my penis. It's called the Octagon, but I also <laughs> nickname my testes. My left one is James Westfall, and my right one is Dr. Kenneth Noisewater. You know, get a couple of cocktails in me, start a fire in someone's kitchen, maybe go to SeaWorld, take my <laughs> pants off. I'm Rick Tamlin. I am polite, and I'm rarely late. 
Years later, a doctor will tell me that I have an IQ of 48. <laughs> People call <laughs> mentally retarded. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. The guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was so good. Ryan, you gotta meet I gotta fucking start IQ crying. IQ of 48. <sighs> Oh, is that the, um, what you called, man? Recognize her ass. Excuse <laughs> <laughs> me. Is it Christine Applegate? It is. Hello. Hello. You have an absolutely breathtaking hiney. <laughs> do you know who I am? Ron Bergen. No, I, I can't say that I do. I don't know how to put this, <laughs> but I'm kind of a big deal. People know me. I'm very important. Uh, I have many leather-bound books. <laughs> My apartment smells of rich mahogany. <laughs> <laughs> Can I start over again? I want to be on you. <laughs> wait. Wait, 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 wait. I want to be on mm. you! I want to be on you. Ron wow. Burgundy, man. What that brick said was absolutely hilarious. Little man. <laughs> I literally, like, literally proper just had us going. Wow. You know how to cut to the core. <laughs> <laughs> Come again. You know I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> you pooped in the refrigerator. <laughs> He must have only just like said, just let the dog bark and I'll just ad lib all the way. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, this has been brilliant. Yeah. This has started off so funny. My actual like stomach was hurting. And I shit a squirrel. <laughs> I mean, literally. Hell of it is. Damn thing's still alive. <laughs> I think I ate your chocolate squirrel. <laughs> oh no. In addition, a lot of you have been hearing the affiliates complaining about a lack of diversity on the new. It's gonna be, it's gonna be that woman, isn't it? Yeah. It is. Veronica Corningstone. Veronica Corningstone. I just want you all to know that I look forward to contributing to this news station's already sterling reputation. But they don't belong in the newsroom. It is Anchor Man. I don't know what we're yelling about! <laughs> 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 and her hair smells like cinnamon! Loud noises! <laughs> Loud noises! Relax, she's not gonna take anyone's air to periods attract bears. <laughs> bears can smell <laughs> <laughs> Just great. Uh, Grab a desk in the bullpen. You can use my office and afterwards maybe we can go to lunch! <laughs> Why did he shout? Very voice, Ron. <laughs> oh, she is a saucy mama. Oh, she can hear them. Every station is the same, because the only way to win is to be the best. The very best. Well, well, well. Hello, S Man Tooth. I didn't know the Salvation Army was having a sale. <laughs> Vince Vaughn. Where did you get those clothes? At the toilet store? <laughs> yes, Brick. <laughs> I will smash your face into a car windshield and then take your mother, Dorothy Mantooth, out for a nice seafood dinner and never call her again. Dorothy Mantooth is a steak! <laughs> Leave the mothers out of this, all right? Why is he stunned like that? It's not necessary. <laughs> they're angry and they're not like fighting. I hate you, Ron Burgundy! I hate you! But you and I are mature adults. We've both seen our share of pornographic materials. Right, I'll stop by the school a little later, Sister Margaret. <laughs> and this cat show thing is grade A baloney. Let me just grab this. Oh! You're trying to touch my breast, aren't you? What can I say? I like the way you're put together. Let me get this over here. Oh! Sorry. Time to musk up. Musk up. Mm. Whoa. Ceases to amaze me. She gets a special cologne. The box. It's gonna be in the it's box. It's called Sex Panther by <laughs> Odeon. It's illegal in nine countries. Illegal in nine countries. Made with bits of real panther. 
so you know it's good. It's quite pungent. Stings the nostrils. Brian, I'm going to be honest with you. That smells like pure gasoline. <laughs> They've done studies, you know. 60% of the time, it works every time. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Uh, Let's right. see if we can make this little kitty purr. 60% of the time, it works every time. What is that smell? Like a used diaper filled with Indian food. What is that? It smells like a turd covered in burnt hair. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It smells like Bigfoot's dick. I would like to extend to you an invitation to the pants party. Brick, are you saying that there's a party in your pants and that I'm invited? That's it. Did Brian tell you to say this, Brick? <laughs> yes. No, I don't want to go to a party in your pants. Very well. Ian. No, Brick. Ice queen. Mm. I just burned my tongue. <laughs> He's so stupid. So good. 1001. 1002. I wasn't expecting company. Well, you asked me to come by, sir. Oh, did I? You are pathetic. Squire you about town as one professional helping another professional because I know what it's like to be lonely in a new city. That's not bad. See, that's a good thing. Really? Yeah, that's a yes. nice. That's nice. But now I am. I am too hurt. I could do that. As a journalist, I should get to know the city that I'm covering, but this is not a date. No, of course not. Oh, but let's, uh, <laughs> she's doing that wrong, and everyone's trying to fucking so I get into her. Eight o'clock? <laughs> mm. Nine. <laughs> Mr. Bergen, do you have a massive erection? Yes, I do. Um, I'm sorry, it's the, it's the pleats. Don't act like you're not impressed. Don't act like you're not impressed. I have a situation right now, Joy Walker. <laughs> He's just walking around the office. There she is, Veronica. Strictly professional. Doesn't mean we can't have fun. Oh my god. To a lookout. Greatest city in the history of mankind. <laughs> Discovered by the Germans. They named it Santiago. Of course, in German means a whale's vagina. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, there's no way that's correct. I'll be honest, I don't think anyone knows what it means anymore. Doesn't it mean Saint Diego? No. No. No, that's that's what it means. Agree to disagree. <laughs> and you're gonna say that. Mm -hmm. Agree to disagree. Well. Yes, I am going to have Yeah, you didn't even let her order. With a little bit of pepper. Always let the lady order first. Remember that. And then kick the vermouth in the side with a pair of steel toed boots. Mr. Burgundy! Gino! It's so good to see How you. Are you. Okay, that was a quick drink order. Mm. We will be honored if you will play jazz flute for us. You play jazz flute? I dabble. This is I don't know if he's going to be like really good he or is. like. I bet, he's, I bet he's brilliant. Harlem Shakedown, E flat. He's <laughs> <laughs> <You> just. <laughs> Just stepping on people's food. <laughs> oh, she likes it. Thank you. To one day become a network anchor. We share the same dream. I too want to be a network anchor. What if just for tonight, we weren't co-workers, we were co-people? No, mm -hmm. and the next day he's going to tell everybody. Oh, I'm storming your castle on my steed, milady. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, dear you, mate. Yeah. He's going to tell, he's going to tell everybody the next day. Mm -hmm. She's going to be like, cheers. Either that or it's not real. Nah, it is. He's dreaming. I friggin' love you! Well done, sir. Tip of the cap to you as well, Miss Corningstone. <laughs> Tip of the cap. We should keep it relatively quiet around the station. Absolutely. Oh, no, it's not. He's gonna tell everybody. Oh, no. Veronica Corningstone and I had sex, and now we are in love! Yeah, you pretty much yelled it. No, run! Help it. Love. Yeah. What is that? <laughs> well, I think I was in love once. What was her name? I don't remember. 
No. That's not a good start, but, <laughs> but keep going. It's Brazilian. Or Chinese or something weird. <laughs> what? what? I love lamp. Do you really love the lamp or are you just saying it because you saw it? I love lamp. I love lamp. Picking up is working up my appetite. Looking forward to a little afternoon delight. Woo! Afternoon delight. <laughs> you guys have it, I think. Huh. Afternoon delight. <laughs> no wrong. <laughs> delighted broke in and song. Yeah. Then ended. <laughs> like nothing happened. Afternoon delight. <laughs> I'm gonna make a phone call here. Freshen this up. Can't believe he's meant to have been discretion. Like and then he's just mm -hmm. shouted it and told everybody. I'd also like to share with you that we are currently dating. And that she is quite a handful in the bedroom. Uh well that's gonna do it for all of us here at six o'clock. I might be in trouble on that one. In today's top story in Ron Burgundy's world mm. read something like this. I love Veronica Corningstone. She wants to make her way at the top without looking like she slept away at the top. Mm. I'm a mess without you. I miss you so damn much. Ron, you're our leader. Look what you're doing to the group. Champ's been a mess. Rick can't sleep at night. <laughs> but not Oh, honey, I am so glad you're home. <laughs> you look great. No eye contact. <laughs> no eye contact. I've spent all day cleaning your Emmys and preparing dinner in the nude. Oh, I need to go to the front I love my life. It's <laughs> <laughs> asking for a lot. I'm telling you, this lady has really crawled into Ron's head. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. <laughs> <laughs> it's filling. Oh shit! Ah! Oh mate, why would you just throw a burrito, full out, the burrito window? out the window? A full burrito. It's a Chuck Black. It's Chuck Black. <laughs> <laughs> throw a burrito out your window. Chuck Black. I believe I did. What are you high or something? You destroyed the only thing I love. All right. My friend Baxter here. Well, guess what? Now this is happening. Excuse me. What do you Excuse me. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's how I roll. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why did he, he kick the dog off the side of the bridge? He just <laughs> kicked the dog off? I am ready to go on. There's never been a woman anchor. Mr. Harkin. This city needs its news. Fantana. <laughs> the man put it back, sir. I mean, I shouldn't have laughed, but it was so funny mm. the way he just kicked the dog. Right. Jack Black kicked yeah. the dog off the bridge. Jack <laughs> off the bridge. That's what he did. Someone punted him? <laughs> Wait, let me say something. Let me say something. <laughs> 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 I don't under- I didn't understand a one word you said. <laughs> oh, I'm in a glass case of emotion! He's gonna put garbage stone on! <laughs> I've got to do the <laughs> You're not Ron. <laughs> Good luck, lady. Ready then out. I hope she does really well. I'll do as well. Yeah. One slip. And you're gone. She's gonna be good. Mm -hmm. Ron Burgundy is off tonight. I'm Veronica Corningstone. Made off with over twenty thousand dollars from an area <laughs> bank, and the winner of the frog leaping contest was Hoppy with a jump of. <laughs> I'm Veronica Corningstone, and thanks for stopping by, San Diego. She did a really good job. Well done. Thank you. <laughs> I have something so magnificent to tell you. Listen, I, I'm listen, here. I have Veronica filled in for you. <gasps> what? Darling, I did the news and I nailed it. I nailed it. Just be proud of me as a peer and as my gentleman lover. Oh, jeez. You read my news! I told you that I wanted to be an anchor. I thought you were kidding! <laughs> Get out! Just go! You, we are through! You have broken my heart, Mr. Burgundy. You have broken my heart. Oh, Ron's a dickhead. Mm -hmm. He thinks that's his, not his news. It's the news that needs to be. It's six o'clock news. Mm -hmm. He wasn't there at six o'clock. Our co-anchor. Co- what? No. Oh, no. Oh, oh. 
No! No! Cool, Anke. What is this, amateur hour? So there's two of them. They're going to be arguing. It's great. Why shouldn't they broke up with her? Lying. I can't hear what he's saying. <laughs> <laughs> you stay classy, San Diego. And thanks for stopping by. Mainly, stay classy. Thanks for stopping by. Stay classy, I'm Ron Burgundy. <laughs> <laughs> huh, you're a real hooker, and I'm gonna slap you in public. <laughs> you have way too much pubic hair. No. You have man boobs. <laughs> You've got a dirty, whorish mouth, that's what you have. <laughs> I'm gonna punch you in the ovary. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Straight shot. Ooh, ow. Right to the baby maker. <laughs> to the baby maker. Jazz flute is for little fairy boys. Why don't you just start cleaning up your desk, and we'll see you in the morning. We'll pick you up in a van. Are you and Champ having a good time today, Ron? Are, are we what? I can see you. Bye-bye. <sighs> Shoot, she knew it was me. You're watching Channel 4 News with five-time Emmy Award-winning anchor Ron Burgundy and Tits McGee. San Diego, yeah. I'm Veronica Corningstone. Tits McGee is on vacation. And I'm Tits. I'm Ron Burgundy. <laughs> the, oh, like, I'm trying to outdo each other. Buy new suits. Yeah! <laughs> <Bad girl. laughs> I'm gonna make a mind if it takes all night. Can you they enjoyed this? Yeah, it's, it's great. Been really, really good. good. Yeah. Rick, I thought you said this was a shortcut. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Burgundy and the ladies went out for a little stroll, huh? Your hiney and tell you that it's special and different from everyone else's. <laughs> Rick, it's over there. Rick, get back over here. I, I want a polka. He's got a grenade. A grenade. Rick, where'd distance. you get a hand grenade? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get a gun grenade? I don't know. If you're gonna have a fight, then don't forget Channel 2 News. It's gonna be Channel Oh my god! Channel 4. Tim Robbins? No mercy! No! Throw the grenade, brick. Oh my god, Ben Stiller. Beaches. Ben Stiller. Which news is here? Oh. Why is like there's so many cameos? No idea. Like Jack Block. It's good though. No touching of the hair or face. Of course. This is war. They're just going to war. He's on fire. I'm going to straight up murder your ass. He's only he had his arm chopped off. I thought they weren't gonna hurt each other properly. He shot his arm cool. That escalated quickly. <laughs> I mean that really got out of hand fast. Yeah, I stabbed a man in the heart. <laughs> there were horses and a man on fire, and I killed a guy with a trident. Every newsman in this city's laughing at us. I feel sorry for her. She hasn't done anything, really. Excuse me, Miss Cornerstone. What are you doing? I need to use this machine so I can watch a tape for a story, Ron. I'm showing. I'm showing Jeffrey here my Emmy tape. We are watching history. I'm not a baby. I'm a man. I am an anchor man. You are not a man. And built the Eiffel Tower out of metal and brawn. That's what kind of man I am. You're just a woman with a small brain, with a brain a third the size of us. You are a smelly pirate hooker. <laughs> You look like a blueberry. Why don't you go back to your home on Whore Island? Oh. You have bad hair. Oh. What did you say? <laughs> I <laughs> Looks stupid. Oh. Ah! <laughs> what? No, what? What? No, it's between the two of them. He threw it over he a desk. threw it over the desk, man. What? God, I hate you more. Me. No. She took the antenna off. What's <laughs> up? What you're doing right now? Knights of Columbus, that is. Knights of Columbus. 
will read anything that is put on that teleprompter. Oh no. I mean, eh, me, eh, nga. <gasps> What's she gonna say? Yeah, classy San Diego. <gasps> I'm Veronica Corningstone. And I'm Ron Burgundy. Go fuck yourself, San Diego. <laughs> Oh my days. <gasps> what in the name? No! <laughs> Talk to Bob Ice City that way! Ron Burgundy's ass is grass! Nice work, everyone. Sharp broadcast. Ron, I've got to fire you. Well, I've got to fire you. Bing, bong, bong. Do you even know what you just said? <gasps> oh, great Odin's Raven! <laughs> great Odin's Raven? He put that in the teleprompter. My hands are tied. I, I gotta fire you. Go fuck yourself, San Diego. Why? Why, Ron? You're my hero, Ron. Think like that. Poop. You poop mouth. <laughs> poop my mouth. I hate you, Ron Burgundy. I hate you. Oh, no. Everybody hates him. That's bad. I think she's overstepped the mark. Yeah. I can't believe you did this to me. It was supposed to be a joke. I've been reduced to rubble. Don't you know I would never say fuck? Fuck! Oh, he's done. No! It's your fault, Veronica. Yeah, fuck. It is her fault, like. Yeah, uh, yeah. Mr. Burgundy, you should be ashamed of yourself. Disappointment with all the Burgundy. <laughs> Shows that her baby is doing quite well. No! Hasn't even been changed. <laughs> Rob Burgundy, you stay classy. <clears throat> Hello, this is Ron. Baxter! Bark twice if you're in Milwaukee. <laughs> is this Will Chamberlain? <laughs> Here you are, Mr. Burgundy. The chef made this special for you. Shit. You eat that for the way you talk about my city. Put that kapoop in your mouth. I if I take one it. bite of shit, will you bring me a steak? I'll think about it. Please. Start with the egg I am so hungry. I don't... There. Oh, God. A steak, a big steak for him, please. Oh. Don't cry. He's not Piece of shit. He's not crying. Guys, it's me, Ron. Fellas! Harkin said he'd fire us if we talked to you. What? What? It's Ronnie! Ron! Champ! Ron! Champ? <laughs> Look at Brick. <laughs> brick! My sweet Brick! It's so damn hot. Milk was a bad choice. <laughs> <laughs> Milk was a bad choice. Three, Three months? months? Oh, wow. shit. Ling Wong, the panda, is giving birth. Oh. She's not free and Ron's gonna go. The feed. I want a shot of that panda being born. Something's gonna happen and Ron's gonna get back in on it. How are you, Ron? I got nothing. All I can see is a blue curtain thing. Sky rockets in flight. <laughs> Afternoon, did I... Gotta have a give a pool, man. Couple of beers. Give a pool. <laughs> Now what the hell is wrong with you? I've got no heart because a she-devil stole it. The ladies can do stuff now. <laughs> and you're going to have to learn how to deal with that. What? Were you saying something? <laughs> Look, I don't speak Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she don't know something's going she's going to fall in. Goodbye. You know that is so refreshing to me because the struggle that <laughs> Oh, it's going to happen. Where's? <laughs> he threw it. He threw her in there. What a bell end! Get me a phone. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Get me Ron Burgundy. Harkin, Ed, Ed, hello. Appeared in the midst of the biggest <laughs> story of the year. Uh, we we need you down here right away. Does this mean you're asking me to report the news again? Yes. Ed, that's wonderful. Thank you. You have always been a good friend. Right. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> good evening. I'm Ron Burgundy. I'll need my news team at my side. <laughs> news team, assemble! Assemble! <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> hey, Ron. Up. Didn't see you there. We've been here literally the entire time you have. <laughs> I'm a little embarrassed. <laughs> the, 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 the.
I mean, think about what you're asking, man. I think about going down, man. <laughs> Gentlemen, to the news van. To oh, the man. news van. Oh, 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 Network talent scout. Ooh, this is a hot. Oh. Did you just hear something? <laughs> Are you okay? How did you get down there? Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Saving the woman that wrecked me I used to have familiar relations with. This is hard, but God does not want her to live. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Clear now. We go into the bear pit. No! I immediately regret this decision. <laughs> Ron, in case we die here today, yes. there's something that you should know. That dirty trick with the teleprompter, it wasn't <gasps> my... Sweet Eli Whitney's nose, it wasn't you, was it? Yes. No, I did it. You bitch! <laughs> How much I need you. Oh, wrong. Whoa, the, f the size of it! Uh, news team! <laughs> <laughs> A bear fight. You're gonna fight some bears. Oh. <laughs> 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 hey, Ron! <laughs> a furry tractor! <laughs> After today, I'm gonna lie. The rich dog would tie his arm off. We woke up the mama. I don't wanna die. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Baxter. Baxter! Baxter's there! <laughs> Leave these people alone. <laughs> they made you wrong! <laughs> His name is Tatao Jo! <laughs> <laughs> Proudly reporting once again for my Bring her in. anchor, Miss Veronica Coinstone. So he's been hit in the head with a brick? No, no. 72% <laughs> sure that I love you. 72%. <laughs> Champ Kind went on to become a commentator for the NFL, but was later fired after being accused of sexual harassment. Is that a sex <laughs> panther you're wearing? <laughs> Tamlin is married with 11 children and is one of the top political advisors to the Bush White House. <laughs> and they became the first mixed gender network news team. And they're still doing it today. You stay classy, planet Earth. <gasps> oh, great Odin's raven. Oh, by the hammer of Thor. <laughs> Sweet grandmother's spatula. <laughs> Hot pot of coffee. I'm going to shoot you with a BB gun when you're not looking. <laughs> Back of the head. <laughs> <laughs> bloopers, man. Yeah, I love bloopers. You're a dirty bitch. I'm gonna put poison in <laughs> <laughs> You're a dirty bitch. I ate a whole bunch of fiberglass insulation. It wasn't cotton candy like that guy said. My stomach's itchy. <laughs> I pooped a tape recorder. I pooped a Cornish game head. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Yes. Now this is happening. What, what are you doing? What? I bet they had so oh, much no. fun with this man died last year, so we're not gonna... San <laughs> <laughs> Diego, which in German means a whale's vagina. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most ridiculous thing ever. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa.
All oh, right, okay. Right. I'll leave it over to that you. That was so good. I thought it was hilarious. Yeah. It was just so, like, random all the way through. Do I need to ask who your favourite character is, or do you know? Um, probably Ron, or I just thought Brick was absolutely hilarious. I loved Brick. Brick was brilliant. Yeah. Um, I didn't expect it. That's why I was laughing so much when uh, he started saying, yeah, when he said years later, um... I'll like uh, I'll get tested and I'll they'll find out I've got an IQ of forty eight mm-hmm. and I'm what some people would call mentally retarded. <laughs> it's just it was just unexpected. Um, but here's when he's when he's saying I love lamp and stuff. Um, yeah, I just thought it was a great concept, great funny. Will Ferrell, mm-hmm. perfect role for Will Ferrell. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, I don't think he could have done that any better. No, it was just I think every member of like the the team. Had the perfect role. Yeah, yeah. Um, one of my favorite parts was the uh, the Cologne would have won as well. Sixty mm-hmm. percent of the time it works every time. Like it makes no sense at all, but it was good. They got loads of cameos in as well. Yeah, you had like you had like um, Ben Stiller, Vince Vaughn, um, Tim Robbins came in, uh, Danny Trejo, Jack Black. Um, Jack Black. Uh, there was a lot of people that jumped in, but obviously you know Judd Apatow is a very well known uh, actor and director, so. He was able to call in a few people to get on board. Mm-hmm. And, you know, when when you've got, like, a big ensemble cast, as they did there, where you had, like, your, um, your Paul Rudds and uh, your Steve Carrolls and Will Will Ferrell and Christina Applegates and stuff, you know, it's it's easy to pull in, like, a, a like a few cameos, especially, you know, there must, must have been... People must have been watching it going, this is hilarious, mm-hmm. and saying this is going to do really well. And I can understand now why it's such a cult classic, because it's a quick movie, but it's really funny. Um, I'll probably pick up a lot of like, I don't know, like a, a like a, a I'll, I'll like a lot of things that have been used off this, like memes or like one liners and stuff, mm-hmm. and I'll probably pick up on them now that I've, I've, I've watched the movie. Yeah, but did, did I loved it? Yeah, yeah, I thought that was a bit one way. I thought it was pretty harsh what she did. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, and then she regretted it. And then she like, did regret away. it. But, but, uh, yeah, it was funny. Mm-hmm. Thanks everybody. Uh, really appreciate it. Um, if you liked it and you thought, you know what, they're, they're quite silly, but it was funny and I'll watch some more. We'll put a playlist of other stuff we've seen down there. Put a subscribe button at the top. Turn your notifications on. We'll see you all very, very soon. Yeah, that was actually really, really, mm-hmm. really funny.